let's see how nice it is. Oh. No. 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 Welcome back to Wonderful Stays Home Tours. My name is Brian. And I'm Hung. We're here in Santa Clara, California, taking a look at the Nuevo community by Summer Hill Homes. We're going to take a look at their E-Town Plan 3 today. It is a four bedroom, three and a half bath, two car garage, and a 2,236 square feet home starting from $1,750,000 with an HOA of 384. If you're interested in real estate, looking for homes in the Bay Area, or just need more interior design, design ideas come with us on this tour let's go that would have been funny yeah yeah we can. oh my god no your favorite locked yeah that's it yeah thank you hand sanitizing station with no hand sanitizer i like the window on the door and this window too, actually. So much space. So bright. Extremely bright. Or makes it a lot brighter. It's not too bright now, because uh, it's getting a little evening time. Whoa! So Any way to turn that off? Oh, okay. Yeah, all the cabinet makes it so dark. Oh, this is a nice wall. Menu, French toast, eggs, juice, orange juice. Pretty nice. Thank you. This is a nice breakfast nook, but the table should be more rectangle. Gives you more elbow room. Have you ever tried eating vegan food? If I can hear me. <laughs> Have you ever tried vegan food? Hold on, that's it? Shut the hell up. No, there's one more. Oh, hold on. <laughs> yeah, it's hard to see that one. Yeah, I did. It was... Good? My sister wanted to try this Indian place. Ah. Uh... Okay. Just okay? Nice. Oh, there's a walk path down there. I mean, I wouldn't eat it again, but... <laughs> it was a good thing to try once in your lifetime, right? Yeah. I like this, though. Nice fridge that goes all the way into your... your, um... your cabinet. This is really nice. How you have the window on the bottom. I really like that actually. Such a good pet friendly um, idea. Get cozy, stay a while. Okay. Interesting. Yeah, that's the model we just went to. Oh, not just, but that's that game room one. Okay. Yeah, all these AC units are just... You know, you're buying a brand new home. And all those units make it feel so old. Is this how old, older homes had it? Because they didn't have centralized AC. But yeah. Nice pattern in the back, though. 
Nice tiles on the floor. Nice. Okay. I like this little hallway with your um, sliding door closet there. That's a pretty nice idea. This wallpaper, huh? No, it's actually wood panels. Huh. That's pretty cool. I do like that. Looks like a little breakfast area. I mean, um, uh, food place. Hmm. Kind of small, but not too bad. Yeah, it looks like the tiles are coming off too. It's not too heavy or they didn't use enough glue. At least in that home. Two thousand two hundred square feet. This is nice. Amazon. Cool. Huh. Little kids play area. Or play toy. Huh, this is a cool. No cabinets. But you have a little. Let's see, what is it? Okay. That's a nice idea. That will take away the door. Or just put some shelves up here. Nice cabinet space to your Jack and Jill. Pretty clean. Wash your hand. Mother is on number thirty-seven. That one was the thirty-six and. The other 36. Nice dinosaur bank. That's a cool one. I would like that as well as a kid. Eric. E equals MC squared. One of the most famous formulas. <laughs> and one of the simplest looking formulas. Interesting. This is kind of cool, actually. Yeah. Really metal. Really, really metal. Huh. Nice cabinet. Ooh, look at the fan. Wooden fan. Nice. The periodic table. Once you learn how to use the periodic table, it's pretty useful. If you're into chemistry, that is. Ooh, that's nice. Nice egg chair. Alphabet. And plants. That's nice. Nice bed. Ooh, this is pretty nice white and green. White and green is also another nice color, huh? That's a pretty nice heart. That's a really nice heart, actually. Huh. Okay, I take that. I take back my comment in that master. I guess that is the smallest master, but this is the smallest walk-in ever. That's it. That's it. All you see right there is the walk-in. What's the point of it then? I don't know. Once upon a time. This is a nice bookshelf idea. Yeah, because the book covers can make a really nice art, huh? Or art pieces. Yeah. 
Interesting wind, uh, not too bad. So this is the master, eh? Another small walk-in closet. I guess it's better than no walk-in closet. Like the home in um, Sunnyvale by DR. They just had a 2X um, regular sliding door closet, but they put two doors opening. I don't get it. I don't get some of the design sometimes. But yeah. Pretty cool. I like the barn door idea. Really nice. Yeah, there's no. That's the bad thing about like homes in California. There's like not much privacy. You look across, you see your neighbor. But yeah, the land here is so expensive. And you pay millions of dollars and yeah, I don't know. This is pretty nice. I like the tiles in the back. It looks like something you see in the kitchen, but at least it continues all the way to your his and hers. And here she has nice flooring tiles too. At least it's, you're not afraid that it's gonna get dirty. Here's your toilet area. Pretty small though. His and hers is super small. Oh, not too bad. Well, I guess this whole thing makes upstairs make up for the smaller space, it seems like. Let's see how nice it is. Oh! No. No. No, no. Oh, this is an in-law. No, oh, this is your. This is an in. Oh, entertainment room. Entertainment area. Interesting. Would you give up more space in your master for an entertainment area? I don't know. Yeah. This is cool though. Nobody won. I'm always in one. Yeah. Huh. I do like this though. This Terrence. Or it's a deck. And the fireplace. This is cool. Interesting tiles. fireplace is cool yeah you see so much wasted space out there the neighbors they could have expanded this so much more I guess they wanted to save money huh save material costs I mean I can't explain why right how, how do you explain not maximizing up your space if you're gonna do four stories anyways. I don't know. Pretty cool. California. Yeah. Palm trees. So you have two powder rooms. Does that count as one bathroom? No. No, I'm just kidding. I, I don't think so. Because there's no shower, right? Okay, Brian, what do you think of E-Town Plan 3? What I like about this home is that when you walk up the stairs, the kitchen caught my eye. The cabinetry colors, it plays off really well. And once again, they have the glass panels only on two of the cabinet trees. I wish they would have done it on all of them. The other thing I like about this home is that when you go up into the design kid room, there's a nice bookcase on the wall. 
which is really cool because instead of buying an actual bookcase, you have it right there on the wall instead. The last thing I want to say about this home is that the deck, even though it's upstairs on the top floor, you really don't get a good view. There's probably just a small view if you look to your right, but that's not really a view for me. A view would have more eye appeal instead of just seeing homes blocking your uh, view. So I think if you're gonna go upstairs into that deck area, you're just gonna be sitting there in front of the fireplace. Okay, Ha, huh? what about you? What do you like about this home? There's a couple nice interior design ideas in this home. From the triangle tiles on the second floor, from the wood panels as an accent wall in one of the bedrooms, and the tiles on the floor in the laundry room are really nice interior design ideas. Another thing I really like about this home in general is that the restrooms have uniform tiles layout from the floor to the rest of the wall. It's actually pretty nice. The last thing I like about this house is that there's an actual breakfast nook instead of an island. It feels like you're in a restaurant and it's a pretty good idea. Hope you enjoyed the tour of E-Town Plan 3. We're going to take a look at an apartment complex on Monday. We're going to take a look at the Anson Apartments by Greystar in Burlingame. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. See everyone again on Monday. Have a good weekend.